What's up, fam? It's your girl Q back at Blessed to Be a Blessing, where we are blessed to be a blessing. Thank you so much for tuning back into my channel tonight. I want to thank everybody for watching and liking and commenting on my last video, my graduation video. Thank you for all the congratulations. I love you guys so much for it. We're going to jump right into it tonight. We are going to do a Puma haul. That's right. Puma is my favorite athletic brand since the pandemic, actually. So just to show you what I've been doing, kind of like collecting Puma shoes and clothing. I'm just going to do the shoes tonight, though, and show you guys what I got. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. All right. All right, guys. So this is our collection here. We have 16 different pair of Pumas, and I'll just go uh, show you them up close. Maybe you can buy some for your loved ones. It is still just a few days before Christmas. All right. And so these are a pair of casual Pumas that I just purchased. Really, really comfortable. I've worn them once, but I love them because they have a lot of stretch here. And like all of the Pumas do now, they have that insole that says uh, soft foam. And guys, it really is soft. The most comfortable shoe I've worn in years. All right. So that's that, which is a casual shoe. Then we have our Puma Romas, which are, these are like classics. Like, <laughs> I don't know what Puma isn't a classic, right? So anyway, yeah, we have these nice Puma Romas. We got the gray with the white swish and a little highlight of yellow. Love it, right? And then we got the gold uh, trimming for the Puma. Of course, it's got that soft insole. It doesn't say soft foam, but it is a softer shoe. It's got it's more of like a nylon texture right here, and then you got like the uh, it's kind of suede type of leather right here. And of course, of course, you got that nice bubble gum. So these are killer, y'all, especially if you got a nice outfit to match. All right. And then these here, uh, these are actually some just a little casual shoes, more like a walk-in shoe. Very, very comfortable. I usually wear these when I'm just hanging out with my homegirl. We go get something to eat. Of course, they all have the nice little Puma on there. Just give you just a little bit of design, you know, not a whole lot. Very simple. So there we go with that. Of course, this right here is one of my favorites, absolute favorites. It's super comfortable. I have worn this shoe uh, about two or three times. Very comfortable shoe. I like the, the trim in silver. And then the back has a really cute little silver, little like flowery design. It's got the nice air bubble in the back. Oh, man, y'all, these are so bomb. I love these so much. And I like the where you get this right here on the tongue. You can kind of like pull them. It helps you pull them on. And the same thing for the back. You don't need a shoehorn. You just pull that to help you get into the shoe. These actually come in wide. I got these in a size six wide in ladies. Um, I normally wear like a seven in ladies regular, but I could do a six wide. Very comfortable. My favorite. Same style. I'm not exactly sure what this particular style is called, but I love it. Uh, it's just like that last one I showed you, but of course, without the flower design, it actually has a nice little knit type of texture. Ah, oh, so bomb. And then it has the leather trim around it. And I just like how it's highlighted with that nice little burgundy, even on the sole of it. Oh. Then you got your Puma in like a little pinkish burgundy-ish color. Just a nice little highlight. And then the same here with the tongue uh, and the heel of the shoe for um, ease of putting them on. Very comfortable. As you can see, look, super flexible, super soft. Y'all, these are bomb. Favorite ones. Now, these are actually a size 7 in ladies. So, the, like a 7 regular. All right. That same brand. This one I probably love more than all of them because it's just I like that that cool navy blue. Like I had seen a shoe like this probably ever. So when I saw it, I was like, I have to have it. And this trimmed in like a light pink. Very cute. The same little knit type of texture. And then that um, leather trim around it. The pink Puma. Very, very bomb. Super flexible this is actually a size six and a half in ladies because the seven is just a little bit like too big in the toe area for me but the six and six and a half it fits perfectly around my foot i like for my sneakers to fit snug with a, a nice little thin pair of socks speaking of sizes if you wear a size seven in ladies six and a half or six in ladies or even like a five and a half in um boys or children's 
let me know. Drop it in the comments. You never know what I might do with that information. All right. You know we're blessed to be a blessing around here. That's what we do. It is Christmas time. Okay. <laughs> All right. So that's another favorite. And then these here. Oh, man. I love these soft foams as well. These are like my favorite for when I go on my walks um, around the neighborhood or wherever it is, at the gym, whatever it is that you want to do. Very comfortable for working out. They are very flexible. Same thing. You have that nice, comfortable, flexible knit material trimmed with a little bit of the uh, leather suede type of texture around here. I just like how it's got that pretty royal blue and then it's like trimmed with the dark blue. Tight. I like them. Nice little Puma sign in the back. Very nice. Now, these are actually a size five and a half in boys. So, pretty much whatever you wear in ladies, you can go like a size and a half down in children's. And I believe children's, like juniors, children's goes to like a size six and a half. So, it's a good way to save money because usually the junior shoes are a little bit less expensive. All right. Then we have, this is what started it all, y'all. I was on a mission for a pair of orange shoes this summer i just had to have them i had a nice sweatshirt that was like had some orange in it and i wanted to really make that orange pot with a pair of orange sneakers and i found these online and by the way most of these shoes do come from the puma website puma.com so check it out y'all they have some of the bomb sales like it's amazing and then you can like it, they have all kinds of deals where you can, like, if you don't want to pay for it all at once, like, they have, like, these two different companies that you can kind of, like, split your payments up just in case you order a whole lot. And you're like, oh, wait, I don't want to spend all this at once. But anyway, I think the name of uh, the companies is, like, uh, Car Klarna or Karna. You guys may have heard them because they work, you know, you can use these under other um, stores um, and uh, uh, Afterpay, something like that. But anyway... This is how it all started. These are so dope. These are the Romas as well. Another classic. Leather. Very. Now, these are firm right here. So, I actually had to go up in size on these. I had to get these. Well, actually, no. These are five and a half in boys as well. I do have these. Uh, well, I'll show you. I got, the, got them in black and white as well. Um, and I went up on a, to a six and a half on those. I don't know if the color made a difference, but the orange fit good. And a five and a half juniors um but the black and the white i had to go up a little bit maybe it was the, the material because this is like a harder type of leather um i don't know you would think it would stretch more but anyway look at that sole yes sir yes ma'am look at that y'all this shoe is so bomb I, like i said this is the shoe that started this collection and i still have yet to wear it ain't that something <laughs> all right and then here's the black romas uh, these are the ones I was I was telling you guys about. I had to go up. Yep, six and a half boys. Uh, they were just a little bit snug. I don't know why. So I sent the five and a half back. Got the six and a half. I've worn these once. Very comfortable shoe. Very casual. Like if you want to go out, like I actually wore these to like a tapas bar to go celebrate my friend going off to med school. And you know, I just wanted to dress casual. I didn't want to dress up. So I threw these on with my outfit and worked perfectly. And again, here we, here we go with the white ones. Whoo, crisp, crisp white. Look at that. I have never worn these. And I will tell you guys, I am so hard on sneakers and purses. I just am. I don't know why, but I am. So I try to preserve the white ones. Like, seriously, if I could just hold on to them and not wear them so they can stay pretty and white, I will do that. So there we go. And then, now y'all know these right here, straight classic. Straight classic! You hear me? Listen, the real suede. It's that Puma suede, baby! They had these on sale for $30. Dollars, Y'all, now you know I was about to get every single color because that's the type of shopper I am. If I find something I like, I want it in every color. I, that's how I shop. However, they didn't have every uh, color in my size. So I went ahead and got the red ones. Of course, red is one of my favorite colors. So these are so bomb. I have not worn these yet. These are definitely going to be for a special occasion. I don't know. Like, I, I'm, I'm thinking about going to a 90s party for New Year's Eve. These would be a good pair to wear as a throwback for that, right? All right. And then, like I said, I love red. These are another pair of red. Ooh, these are so comfortable. Like, these are very good walking shoes. I walk in these a lot. Um, love them. It gives you that, um, that Hirachi by Nike vibe. 
it gives you that vibe, but you know, it actually, you can, you know, the tongue is separate from the top of the shoe. You know, the Hirachis, you kind of like slide in, which is the reason why I don't, they don't fit me well. So I was happy to find these and these are so bomb y'all. Like I love these. These are probably one of the most comfortable pair, like seriously, especially for walking and they're cute. Look how stylish. Dope. I got a lot of compliments on those. Back to my little favorite design. Oh, and so I, I have the white leather and then this is the white with that white mesh. Look how it's got the silver, the silver sparkling strings. Um, then you got that white leather trim, that silver Puma. Man, listen, got the air bubble. Listen, bomb, okay, bomb. I've only worn these once. Like I said, with whites, I try to keep them clean. So that means don't wear them too much. And then these are so cute. I have a really cute pink outfit to go with these. So y'all remember pink and gray back in the day? Like if, if you're my age, you know, pink and gray used to be the colors, honey. If you wore those together, that means you were doing it, baby. Okay. So I, I had a flashback when I saw these. Had to have them. Nice little mesh uh, material on these as well. Trimmed with that same kind of leather suede. That white swish on it. And this pink highlight, though. That just like really takes the cake. It really does. Just a little bit of pink, like a splash of color. Y'all, these are bomb. I love them. Haven't worn them yet. <laughs> and then another pair of my uh, walking shoes. I like these because oh, the colors just look so good together. Same mesh material with the suede trimming and then that yellow swish. Just a, you know, that touch of color just makes it pop. So I love that navy though. This navy blue is bomb, especially if you have like a nice pair of blue jeans. You could you could rock like a navy blue top or a yellow top or just all navy or just like uh, one solid color. Maybe you want to wear something white and then put these on. Mm, now you know you're gonna be doing it then, okay? So that is my Puma haul. I do want to thank you all for joining me again. Today is Vlogmas day number 20. Oh my gosh, we have 11 more days, guys. I have so many ideas and so many other things that I need to get in. I'm going to try to get them all in. Right now, I just want to fit things in as far as, far as my hauls so that, you know, we still have time for Christmas. So if you want to do some Christmas shopping and you need some ideas, these are some ideas. Like we have the perfume haul, we have the Puma haul, and then I have a couple of more hauls for you. So make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of these videos okay thank you again to all of my winners and um subscribers who participated in the giveaway challenge i love you ladies to life i was so blessed to be able to give to you guys and just so you know i gave because it was from my heart i give to give i don't give to receive so i don't want you to think that you have to give back to me. That is not what giving is, okay? I don't expect anything back when I give. And so, like I said before in the, uh, my last video, I will be doing more holiday giveaways. I just think it's a, a beautiful thing. I think it's a beautiful way to bless people, okay? So, anyway, thank you all for tuning in to my uh, show and my channel tonight. I appreciate you and all of your support. Um, also, we have finally reached our goal of 100 subscribers hey! all right we did it my day ones i love you i love you to life i wish you all of god's blessings okay i love you thank you for your support all of the content creators who shout me out who support me my girl kendra giles living life with tia holler at my boy Vern bang who actually helped take me over that hump to get me to 100 um 100 subscribers a couple nights ago man listen y'all are the reason why i keep doing this i love it so much i love to share I love to give, and I love the fact that here on YouTube, this platform, your subscribers choose you. So if you choose me, you subscribe to me, I know that you rock with me, all right? And I'm here for you. So you got any ideas, you got any feedback, anything, drop it in the comments, y'all. Like to me, y'all are my new best friends. Y'all are my new family members. Let's go ahead and converse, all right? Don't be shy, all right? Again, I'm your girl Q here at Blessed to Be a Blessing, where we are blessed to be a blessing. Remember, you reap what you sow, so you better sow some good. Merry Christmas!